Hi there, Upper Room. This is Mark and Christine in Bezeco. Um, as you guys are aware, you are recently you, you generously donated some funds to us. We saw a, I saw a video on YouTube of your children's church raising um, raising funds for our Bibles and stuff. And we just want to show you a, a few pictures of the Bibles. What we did is we went out and um, we spent nearly $500 of the money you gave, and I think we bought 200 Bibles like this, which is just a Tagalog translation, New Testament only. Uh, these are predominantly for use in church. We found in the past if we give Bibles away to people, they simply disappear and you never see them again. So we have now plastic containers filled with Bibles in all four of our churches. People come to church, they collect a the Bible, they give it back at the end of the day. And then what we do is when people get baptised, they get one of these that is their own, gets written in it, little signature on the front and stuff. And in the last four weeks we've had 15 people baptised, so 15 people have received their own Bible. We also bought a few different types of Bibles as well for our leaders. This is a Tagalog English version of the New Testament. Obviously this is super convenient just for carting around the slum when you're doing Bible studies day by day. Every one of our leaders, all of our youth leaders, also receive one of these, which they love and they just use them all the time. The next level of Bible that we, we bought, uh, again we have different levels of leadership. We have senior leaders and we have up and coming leaders. This is called a Poiman Study Bible, which is completely a, a completely Tagalog, New and Old Testament, and this is sort of for our up-and-coming leaders. So predominantly our youth leaders, they receive one of these. It came in a cover, um, and this is an excellent study Bible. They, they've loved this. This has already been well used. I, I think we, we gave 10 of these ones away to some of our leaders. We have a couple more left here. But then the prize, the one that everyone was hanging out for, is that the day we went to the Bible Society to the day we went to the Bible Society to check the prices and availabilities of the other Bible, this particular Bible, which there is very few genuine study Bibles that are available in Tagalog, this is a very, very comprehensive study Bible, probably equal to say the NIV study Bible or, or any of the other New Life study Bibles. This went to all of our senior leaders, so, so our Pastor Maravik, um, our, our main youth leaders, we gave away 10 of these, and these are a great blessing. When we bought these, these were on 50% discount, they weren't initially in the original plan, but we saw them and felt we can't pass that by, so uh, thank you so much. You, you put a lot of Bibles into our churches, you put a lot of Bibles into the hands of our leaders and our youth leaders. Um, and then the rest, of the, money, the rest of the money that you gave, if you look on the blog over the next couple of weeks, there's a, you're, you're literally building a house for widows and orphans. I mean, that's very biblical, isn't it? This is true and undefined religion to, to bless widows and, and orphans. So we're building a house for a lady who has seven children, but she may well be ended up looking after 11 children. Uh, the house is still being built right now when this video is being made. But in the next couple of weeks, there'll be pictures on the blog, and we'll have the upper room on it. Um, that's what your funds went through, went towards at this at, at this point. We're very, very grateful for your support. Thank you so much. And all the kids there, bless you guys. You did a great job. Thank you.